Karen found everything that she wanted in a man in Daniel and I was just so overjoyed to know that somebody was going to be able to spend the rest of their lives with her and looking after her. So, 30, 40 years from now, hopefully you wake up every morning remembering why you walked down the aisle this day and why you fell in love with each other because in 30, 40 years from now, it'll make so much difference to both your lives to have each other. And I hope that you get that opportunity uh, to say that you love each other every day. And, uh, Without the ones that you love, there is nothing else. He planned a very special dinner on the reef in Dever last time we were in Fiji. He had a special romantic candle lit dinner organised for us on the front deck of the boat. Um, and yeah, we were just sitting there waiting for our dinner and he popped down onto one knee and I asked him three times if he was sure. Are you sure? Do you really want to do this? Are you sure? And then I cried. Just don't ever change, always be you. Be the man that I fell in love with and the man that keeps me sane every single day. To my dearest Karen, I can't wait to see you today. I'm sure you will look amazing in your dress. You'll be the star of the show. Enjoy your last few hours as Miss Kelleher, because soon you'll be Mrs. Lindenberg, and we will have a happy life together. Love your soon-to-be husband. Karen, today I give you all of me. We've been through so much together over the past four years, the good times and the tough times, and here we are, and here we stand on our wedding day stronger because of them. After the day comes the future, the great unknown, and I promise to stand by you, support you in times of need, cheer you up when you are sad, laugh with you when you are happy, watch Grey's Anatomy with you, continue to bring you back to Fiji regularly, but most of all, I promise to give you my heart unconditionally. I love you so much and can't wait to spend my life with you as husband and wife. Hey! Okay.